Hello, welcome to Ludic Science. I just got these uh, small solar cells. I found them in an old box. I bought them some time ago and haven't used them for any project. So I decided to make a small solar panel with the cells. I just checked them under a full sun and each cell produces a little bit more than 7 volts at open circuit and a current of around 250 milliamps in short circuit. So I, uh, I want to make a small 12 volt solar panel. There are 12 cells so it is enough for a 12 volt panel and use the panel to charge 12 volt batteries. And uh, why 12 volt battery? Well, because once you have a source of 12 volts, you can use an inverter in order to run home appliances. So this is what I will do in this video. Okay, here I have the 12 cells. There are four rows and each row has three cells connected in series. Therefore, we have uh, around 20, 21 volts in each of the rows and the rows will be connected in parallel. The connection of the cells is very simple. Each cell has a positive negative, positive negative and positive negative. And in order to connect them in series, you just have to connect the negative of one cell to the positive of the other. And of course, the duct tape is just to keep all the cells together. These are the connections. We have four rows of solar cells connected in series, three cells in series, each cell produces around 7 volts, so we have 21 volts in one row. And the same for the other three rows, and the four are connected in parallel. The parallel connection does not increase the voltage, but gives more output current. Therefore, here at the output we will have around 21 volts maximum and a maximum short circuit current of around 1 amp. And here I have the finished panel. It is mounted on a wooden base and a plexiglass cover to protect the cells. Unfortunately, I have waited for three days, but there is no sun. It is very cloudy and rainy here these days. So the final test will be made in a forthcoming video and I will also add this little module to control the output voltage. And also I am preparing my batteries. I will make a battery bank and I will try to charge the bank with the solar panel. And that's all for today's video. Thanks for visiting the channel and see you in the next one.